Matt Manley here with Josh Michigan of Brick Memorial, fresh off a 30-point night in a 54-47 Brick Memorial win over Tom's River North here at, uh, at the RWJ Barnabas Health Arena. Josh, um, you guys were down 10 uh, early in that second quarter. Um, what got you back in the game other than just, you know, kind of catching fire offensively there? I think we all knew we had to just wake up, and we, were, we really started off to a slow start. And um, as soon as we started pressing, I really think they couldn't handle it, and we were getting a lot of steals, a lot of easy buckets. Now just getting us hype, our bench hype and everything. Yeah. Did you have to kind of match energy a little bit? It's a very athletic team they have there. Um, they beat you on the offensive glass a little bit early. Was there, was there something you guys had to adjust to that they were doing? Yeah, definitely. Um, we uh, we didn't come out as aggressive as we like, and we just really wanted to come out more striking because they they play like football team and they're really aggressive, so we had to match it. Yeah, and stylistically, do you feel like you know going back to last year, you guys had a six seven center that you know, was able to clean up stuff down low and obviously finish around the rim. But you, know, you guys showed in spots last year that you could go small and be a little bit more, a little more of a quick team. You guys feel like that's the kind of style you're embracing this year? Do you feel like there's some versatility you can kind of exploit yeah, from game to game? Definitely. We're definitely trying to play faster, um, getting up and down the court, pressing a lot. I think our defense was great after this first quarter and we're just playing a lot faster because we don't have a big like that. Yeah, and just what's your comfort level as in your own skin this year, um, being a senior and being able to come out in a game like this and, like you say, have to respond to a pretty physical athletic team and, and do what you did tonight? After the first quarter, I was really comfortable. I was just – no one out there could really guard me. As soon as I got the ball, I could just take anyone out there. Yeah. Tell me about playing with uh, Brian Starrett, too. He's, I, he had – I didn't count him up. He had like eight or nine assists today, which is a pretty routine day for him. Yeah, yeah. Just what um, what's it like playing with uh, a point guard like that who sets guys up the way he does? I, I couldn't ask for a better point guard to play with. We've been playing together our whole lives since fifth, sixth grade, and it's just it's our final ride, and we know uh, we're gonna go out there together as brothers. Yeah, you mentioned the that final ride, and you guys had a really competitive finish to last year. That game at Robbinsville in the sectional semifinal, where you guys are right at the doorstep. Just uh, what sort of work goes into an off season and preparing for a season like this, knowing that there's, you know, there's definitely a next step that you guys want to take as seniors. Uh, that game gave us a lot of a lot of fire in the off season, and we all worked our butts off, uh, got in the gym every day, got a lot of shots up, and uh, we definitely got our cardio up as well. Yeah, yeah. Josh, thanks so much for the time. Uh, good you. luck the rest of the year. Nice job tonight. Thank you.